Hi everyone, I'm Heidi and we are in the Shape Your Future Healthy Kitchen sponsored by TSET and I am with Chef Val from the OUTU School of Community Medicine and I always love doing these with you because we learn so much. So what are we making today? We're just making a really easy summer fruit salad and I say summer you can interchange fresh or frozen fruit okay. that you want to. You could make this all year long but right now since berries are in season mm -hmm. we're using some blueberries, blackberries, raspberries, Strawberries are probably a little out of season for us, but you might still be able to find them. Okay. Just some grapes. Clearly, these are not a, a local item. You can get grapes all the time, but they are super delicious. And just some sliced banana. Okay. And I'm assuming, again, like we've done before, you can you can pick your favorite fruits. Doesn't have to be this as long as you're creating a nice mixture. Right. And, you know, if it's out of season um, and berries are really expensive, consider getting the berry blend because they are a lot more affordable, very okay. good for you, work great in fruit salad. Okay. And so then the next thing we're going to do is just make a little bit of a yogurt dressing to go on that or a yogurt topping. Okay. So you could mix this all the way through and make it um, a dressing that coats all the fruit, but we're just going to make it like almost like a little whipped cream topping. Um, we're going to put a little bit of honey in here, just drizzle some honey in, and we'll of course have the exact measurements um, on the recipe on the website. Perfect. Yes, I'm not as fancy as you where you, where you can just kind of guesstimate it, but it comes in handy for being able to yeah. follow those and, and do those at home, and I hope people do because that's that's what we're trying to do is give healthy alternatives for people. Right. So a little bit of vanilla in here. I mean, you could do something besides vanilla too. You could do a tiny bit of almond extract. Okay. And like right now, mint, if you have a little bit of mint in your oh, garden a good idea. or flower bed, I mean, like it's probably taking over like it is in mine. Mm -hmm. So some chopped mint would be delicious. And then we have some chia seeds that we're going to sprinkle on top, but you could okay. also, you could do anything. You could do um, any kinds of nuts or seeds, but we just chose those because they are a really healthy, crunchy alternative. And I know you mentioned this, but you wouldn't have, you could put the dressing all the way in it of if you course. wanted, or you're just doing it as a topping. Um, you could definitely do that. I will say that it probably keeps better. So if you want to mix all these fruits together and then store them later, it probably keeps a little bit better if you True. don't put the dressing on. Okay. But we will go ahead and just um, do a little dollop of our delicious, sweet, yogurty goodness there and then some chia seeds. Okay. And it just looks so pretty. I mean, you can't help but be excited about right. that. All right. And I get to taste it as always. Can't wait. It's so good and refreshing. Good. It's so pretty, it's so good. It's a perfect way to use any kind of fruit. Right. And enjoy a summer salad. So if you guys want to learn more about this, Go ahead and head to KJRH.com.